We'll guide you through how to unsync a MacBook from an iPhone. If you find this useful, then consider subscribing and liking the video. It can get annoying that the data is the same both on your MacBook and your iPhone, and you may want to go and keep it separate. We'll guide you through how this can be done. There are different things we can do. So if you don't want calls to come through on your MacBook from your iPhone, open settings, scroll to the bottom and press apps. Press search at the bottom and you want to go and type in phone. Press it at the top, scroll down, find calls on other devices. And if you see your Mac here, you can go and switch it off. Next, to stop FaceTime calls coming through on your Mac, go and open it up. With FaceTime open, press FaceTime in the top left and press settings. You can press sign out at the top and confirm your decision. Do the same thing with messages, press it in the top left and you can then go and press settings. Press iMessage at the top and you can then press sign out. Now come to the bottom and open up system settings. Go and press on your Apple account in the top left and you want to go down and press iCloud. Now you can go and see your iCloud apps, press see all to the right here. And what you can do is start going through these and switch them off. I've already switched off photos. I can come into iCloud Drive and go and stop syncing this and you go and get the idea. We can then go and remove it from our Mac, go down the list and go and repeat it. And so you can go and turn off everything you want and unsync what you want.